Well, welcome back, everyone. You know the old saying, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Well, joining me now is Tara LaRoe, clinical nutritionist for UW Health with how something as simple as an apple can truly have an impact on your lifestyle. Right, so the apple, you know, it's kind of the common fruit and yeah. sometimes not so popular anymore because it's being budged out with um, other superstar uh, fruits. But the apple is really packed with a lot of nutrition and health benefits. So it includes a lot of um, fiber, soluble fiber, that's, mm -hmm. um, that will help lower cholesterol. And as well as if you're, um, you know, thinking about weight management, it helps you feel full and uh, fuller longer. Um, the, the skin of the apple actually contains a flavonoid called um, quercetin, and this flavonoid is, has antioxidant properties mm -hmm. and um, is actually shown to improve lung function. Um, and so I brought some, you know, um, up and coming varieties. I am getting of extremely apples. hungry right now. <laughs> Tara, let's start with this sure. one. Now, this is something that uh, I've done before with apples. Mm -hmm. A lot of people do mm -hmm. is dipping it with sure. some peanut butter, yep. but you kind of spice up the peanut butter a little bit. Right. So, you know, you can eat the apple raw. You can dip it in peanut butter. And here I just added a little bit of maple uh, syrup with mm. cinnamon. Um, you can slice it, add it to salads, slice it, add it to sandwiches, wraps. Um, and here is kind of a common in salsa but replacing yeah. it with uh, apples. See, that's very interesting okay because I, when I first looked at that I was thinking you had brought salsa but it is indeed uh, replacing the tomatoes right. like you said with yeah. the apples. Okay and I, I noticed too you have kind of the the cinnamon and sugar going on to a probably good combination. <laughs> sure yeah, right and so again the versatility of apples you can really do anything with them and the the varieties here um, I just have three up-and-coming varieties. Um, the the honey crisp which isn't so new anymore is kind of been popularized the apple again the last couple of years but there's two more new ones that have come out of Minnesota they are grown locally now in Wisconsin, mm -hmm. and this is called the Zestar. And um, then there's a combination between the Honeycrisp and Zestar called um, Sweet Tango. Sweet Tango yeah. and Zestar. Yeah, so okay. look for those in your supermarkets. <laughs> All right. Very good. Uh, so obviously, so many things you can do with apples, a lot more things than I ever imagined. Sweet Tango, Zestar, mark those down, go to your supermarket, get it, and then make some of these things and Feel free to bring them over to the studio. I'm just throwing that out there. Tara, thanks so much for joining sure, us as you. always. And stay with us. Dan, we'll have a final check on that weather right after the break.